Further to the success of the only true patented vacuum insulated ISO 8943 LNG probe and vaporizer developed and continuously enhanced in the 2010s decade, the unmatched performances of the Isoprobe 8100 still prevail on the market with more than 250 up and running worldwide installations selected by the LNG industry. Statistical uncertainty of the probe for the most representative peak dispersion of methane resulted in a repeatability of 0.031% and such a value is currently used as predominant focus in the random error table to ascertain that the LNG is maintained into a liquid phase right up to the vaporizer without fractionation. Standard deviation and repeatability performances are easy to determine with an online GC. The accuracy suitability is more critical to be established. Predominant use is the comparison of bill of loading with analysis at unloading. On this example, C1 at loading is 93.28% versus 93.23% at offloading, and this deviation of 0.05% is confirmed by the predictive model MOLAS of aging during ship transportation. Today, some simulacrums of simplified low-flow vacuum probes with fractionation followed by reliquifaction at extreme low subcooling temperatures emerge on the market, eventually resulting to aberrations such as CH4 measurement in excess due to C2H6 abnormal downward slope during unloading. As another example, any aleatory bubble point occurring the process line will not be detected by this post-fractionation reliquifaction technology resulting to senseless measurements. As this reliquifaction device systematically produces a good linear repeatability, such aberrations are only detectable by comparison between bills of loading and unloading when this information is existing. At time, with peak of CO2 over 500 ppm during the transfer, the vigorous subcooling results to dry icing formation, plugging the probe and this frost, desublimation, at low pressure, around a 4 bar, can only happen from LNG vapor phase directly to the CO2 solid phase. This is an additional proof that at inlet of liquefactor, the LNG is fractionated. Paraphrasing George Bernard Shaw, to any complex problem, there is a simple and wrong solution. The Opta Perif ISO 8943 LNG probe and vaporizer suitability criteria have been carefully checked by the preeminent export and import terminals to be in full compliance with recognized international measurement standards as ISO 8943, EN 12838, and G2I GNL Handbook. The genuine vacuum thermal insulation from the probe tip inside the LNG pipe, all the way up to the vaporizer, along with no heat absorption at the probe flange, is a guarantee that LNG sample remains in subcooled conditions up to the liquid to gas converter. The liquid to gas flashing is operated in supercritical state at the bottom part of vaporizer. The high vacuum technology authorizes to drop to 1000 normal liters per hour the vaporized sample flow rate versus the 27000 liters per hour specified by the ISO 8943 standard for typical insulation material probes. Thus, regarding the simplified probes with low flow rate on the market, sometime not exceeding 1% of the ISO 8943 flow rate figure, their suitability is totally out of the way with consequent fractionation from the header connecting flange, even if reliquifaction is operated upstream of vaporizer to upgrade repeatability by spoiling accuracy. Main ancillaries integration. 
For routine inspection facility, the automatic vacuum generator Vecauto 8100 has been developed and can be retrofitted to old probes. To comply with hazard and operability rules, namely HAZOP, low temperature embrittlement damages are prevented by automatic shuttle valve. Thank you for your attention. For more information, please go to our website www.opta-perif.com